after 500 attempts of trying to get a thumbnail, let's get on with this. Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm back with an empties video. If you guys are new around here, I do an empties video probably every four months. I don't go through a lot of product. This, I mean I do, but it just takes me a long time. So this time I guess I have a good amount. I have this little guy full and a couple things on the side. And it's really like, it's a majority of hair products, um, one or two items of cleaning products, and a random refrigerator product. Coffee product? If you are new to my channel, consider subscribing. I do mommy videos, cleaning videos, meal videos, random videos, just to keep you on your toes. Consider subscribing, hit that red button down below, and let's get to it. So let's get the non-hair stuff out of the way, and the first thing that I'm seeing right here is the Method Antibacterial All-Purpose Cleaner. I had gotten a whole bunch of these, I think five of these, at Target. Got this one in Wildflower. Now, I can't smell if you're new around here, so my daughter actually had to help me pick out what um, scents. So I can't tell you how this smells, but I liked it and how it cleaned. Now the other thing that is not hair related is actually a coffee creamer. And this is a silk almond creamer, caramel flavored. And I got this um, for one because it was um, dairy and lactose free, gluten free, soy free, all the free stuff. And I wanted to see how that tasted. And it tasted pretty good. I um, got it twice actually after I finished this one I did purchase another one and I finished that one and now I'm on a whole different one I'll show you guys that later now the next product that is um, not hair related is makeup I have my NYX retractable lip liner in cocoa and this is like my everyday I have it on right now I'll just put it on chapstick and put on this and call it a day I'm not really a lipstick person or a lip gloss person I choose to use something that's a little bit darker than my natural color and that's what I use for my lip color the next item is this wet and wild contouring palette contour which by the way I have this one and another one and I found out that I'm allergic I got an allergic reaction I hit pan but then um, also my daughter cracked broke the rest of it and I just um, had to throw it away this yellow was way too yellow on me and showed up way too much, so I never really used it. I would try time and time, but it was just way too yellow. So, um, I bought, purchased another one after this one went out, and then I realized that I was breaking out so much in this area. I, um, stopped using it and stopped breaking out so much on my face. So, uh, yeah, that wasn't fun at all to go through that. I'm still breaking out a little bit, but a lot less than I was whenever I was using that NYX contour on my face. The next item, I guess now, is bathroom products. So, I have this Members Mark Moisturizing Body Wash with Shea Butter. And this one says, I think on the package it said it had like compared to one of the ma major brands. And I actually like this a lot. I actually purchased this twice and it's a three pack for like eight bucks. But when I went back to purchase it a third time, they stopped selling them at my Sam. So I couldn't find it anymore. And so I just ended up getting an Olay brand. Um, but I did enjoy this brand. If you have this brand in your area, it was soft and smooth. And ask me how it smells. I don't know. I'm guessing like shea butter. Next item is this Avino Baby Calming Comfort Bath. Now this, now this Avino uh, Baby Calming Comfort Lavender and Vanilla Scented took me a long time to get through. It's a pretty big size and I just use it for my baby. My kids have a history of eczema and um, my last baby needed this um, brand. So I just bought this whenever she was smaller and it took me a long while to get through. But I loved how gentle it was on her body and her skin. I did not repurchase it. But... I do recommend. This next big thing is from uh, it's Pantene Pro V Conditioner Daily Moisture Renewal um, and I purchased it at Sam's Club. I am really liking the pumps, the shampoo and the conditioners and the pumps. And this took me, I use so much conditioner in my hair since it's so long. I use about four pumps. I know that sounds like a lot but I have a lot of hair, very long. So I go through a lot of conditioner. Um, I really enjoyed this one but I decided to I would repurchase this, but I decided to switch it up this next time, and I ended up getting a Herbal Essence 
um, from Sam's Club, but I do like this. So this next item is this um, Herbal Essence. Set Me Up Beautiful Bold Hairspray in level number four. And I really enjoyed this. I used this on my girl's hair. And it held, it holds pretty good. And it doesn't leave a lot of um, white residue on top of their head. Which shows a lot in our hair because our hair is so dark. I also enjoyed this Batiste Dry Shampoo in the dark and deep brown. 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 The dark deep brown. It has a hint of brown. If you spray it, um, like totally... Totally went through this, but I did enjoy this. I'm not a big dry shampoo user. This did take me a long time to go through, uh, but when I did grab for it, I did enjoy this one. I and so I did purchase another Batiste shampoo, but I do not like it. It shows up so much right white residue on my hair, and so I probably will be on the lookout for this one again um, before I go on my trip in a couple of weeks. I have three more items left. This one is the Jergens Ultra Healing. And extra uh, for extra dry skin I have purchased this one for the past it comes in a three pack at Sam's Club I've purchased it for the past two or three years I like how it works um, it lasts longer it's not too sticky um, and yes I would repurchase uh, did I No, I tried something else which I don't like now but I do re I would repurchase and I do recommend now this this next product is the Head & Shoulders Dandruff Shampoo & Conditioner for Men. I had got this one with the with the shampoo and conditioner for men because, see the little clearance price? It was half of this price, half of $4 um, at, a, at a sale at Dollar General. So I use Head & Shoulders, so I said, I thought, hey, you know, um, Head & Shoulders is Head & Shoulders. But I did notice a difference, and I think because it has conditioner, it didn't clean my hair like just a regular Head & Shoulders does for my hair. So I don't think I would be purchasing the shampoo and conditioner, even if it's on clearance. This Paul Mitchell Clarifying Shampoo 3. Now, my son actually had got recommended this whenever he went to go get his hair cut one time. And... If you look at it right away, you see clarifying, right? Which, which I think that's what the lady did. Um, she just saw the clarifying. She had recommended clarifying, clarifying shampoo for his hair, and then just grabbed one off the shelf. Well, I had found out myself when I went to Ulta that there's three different clarifying shampoos. Well, that I saw that Paul Mitchell carries, and this one says shampoo three right here at the bottom. And I also found two other ones that say shampoo two. This one says it removes chlorine and impurities. And the other one says um, the shampoo two. I forgot the other one what it says. I was about to grab that one at Ulta this last time because it's a little bit cheaper. But the other shampoo two, which we actually brought home, that's the one that I needed from the beginning. And it says removes buildup. And so if you are looking for a clarifying shampoo, make sure you, and it's the Paul Mitchell brand, make sure you are reading at the very bottom exactly what it does for your hair because it may say clarifying, but it has very specific uh, details, I can't even, at the bottom of what it does. But I think that is it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed. It will be a while again until I film another empties video. I hope you guys enjoyed. Make sure you guys hit that like button down below and subscribe button if you are not subscribed to my channel. I will see you guys in my next video. Bye. And I don't know why I have this in my head.